the police have found themselves on the front line in this dispute about parades. They've been attacked with petrol bombs, bricks and bottles, and for a second night in a row, the worst trouble has been in North Belfast. At the exact spot where a contentious march was stopped on Friday night. The police were simply enforcing a decision made by others, but they've now become the target of frustrations and anger. For most of the day, protests had been peaceful. Unionist residents stood holding banners and flags near the stretch of road at the centre of this dispute. The Praise Commission is an unelected body that makes decisions that affect the sovereign citizens of Northern Ireland. Who are they? They're right to tell you can't walk a public road. But the disputed march near a nationalist area does raise tensions. Hundreds of extra police officers were brought to Northern Ireland from elsewhere in the UK ahead of the 12th of July. After this weekend's violence, they've been joined by hundreds more. The trouble associated with contentious marches is an expensive and an annual issue for Northern Ireland. The politicians have set themselves a Christmas deadline to try to come up with some sort of solution to the problem of parading. But ask anyone who lives or places in these areas and they'll tell you that it's not going to be easy. There continue to be appeals for calm, but it's clear some people just aren't listening. Chris Buckler, BBC News, Belfast.